Well, howdy, folks. This is Matthew, your friendly neighborhood technician, working on a Honda 1.7 liter engine that we're getting ready to install into a Honda, of course. And I just wanted to take a moment here and show you j just some cool timing information. If you ever find yourself needing to change the water pump or the timing belt on one of these, you can look back in my other videos, and I have videos posted that show uh, how to remove things like uh, the exhaust, the valve cover, and all of that that you need to remove in order to get to the timing cover and all that other good stuff with the engine in the vehicle. So uh, if you need some help on, you know, knowing how to get the timing cover off or anything like that, or any of the brackets that you're going to find on the side for like the power steering pump and all that other stuff, there are some videos that will show you. This video is just specifically going to show you where some of the timing marks are. Now, I normally don't set timing per the marks on the harmonic balancer or the crankshaft. I just go ahead and pull the timing cover and I use the marks on the gears. So before you pull your timing belt, you're going to want to find your timing marks. And let me see if I can get a better light for you here. Okay. And so here you're going to see on your Honda 1.7. Behind the timing cover, you're going to see a timing mark right here. You see that timing mark next to my finger? All right, now that mark is in between two teeth. And if you look on the back, and this is kind of ridiculous because the belt is in the way, you will see right there, you see that arrow? Okay, and so you want that notch to be aligned up with that arrow. You see that arrow inside of there? So you want that middle ring right there where this notch is to be lined up with that arrow. That's per the crankshaft, that's per, per the bottom part. Now on the top part, you're gonna see on your gear, you're gonna see, it's gonna say up right here. So that means that this needs to be up at the 12 o'clock position. Uh, this is a used engine. It looks like somebody's been in here before to service it. So that's a, that's good news. That tells me this engine's been well taken care of. We're going to go ahead and put a new uh, water pump and timing cover on it, our, our timing belt on it ourselves as well, before we install it to ensure the longevity and health of it. So, so yeah, so down here on your Honda 1.7, you're going to have a mark on your lower timing gear, on your crank gear. Line that up with your arrow that you can barely see. That's probably going to frustrate you. And then make sure that you're up here. And then to help you feel better about knowing whether or not you're on top dead center, find the number one cylinder. And if you can peek right down in there, you can see the top of the piston down in there. Let me see. See it? There you go. There she is. You see it? So, so there we go. So now we know we are at TDC and we can go ahead and remove our timing belt and get it replaced and put a new one, put a new water pump on and all that other good stuff. So there's just some simple timing information for you guys. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. If you have any questions, shoot them to us in the comments. We got a pretty cool little community going here. Either myself or somebody else will get back to you with it. Really appreciate all your support. This is Matthew, your friendly neighborhood technician, signing off.